All right, so here we are again. Uh, I didn't know it was going to end that quick. I suppose I was supposed to make a solitary confinement and shit, but... I thought clicking the Polaroid was just going to advance the story. Apparently not, and that was the end of the chapter. So here we are, going on to Chapter 4, Conviction. One of our inmates has been put on suicide watch. Henry Morgan, Benedict's partner in crime. Thirteen months into a five-year sentence. Help us take care of these men. Alright, so it's a buddy of the guy who had all the hostages in the last one. Lenny Kravitz. Let's go prevent him from hanging himself. Oh my god. The lack of engagement at this facility is shocking. Men deprived of every shred of humanity. Yeah, Walter, you know what? You're right. They're being shown scant compassion or respect. Oh shit, I didn't get to re- well. Indeed, Captain. This is no way to treat a human being. They're deprived of every shred of humanity. That's what you just said. We need classrooms, drug rehabilitation programs, a workshop so they can start to take some pride in their skills. You misunderstand me, Doctor. These men aren't human. See for yourself. On your feet, Morgan. Oh, I can't. I'm laying in my own piss, sir. Got a visitor. Rehabilitation? Might as well teach monkeys to play the banjo. Well, I mean... How, how do you know they don't play the banjo? There could be circuses that have monkeys to play banjos. What's your name, son? Man asked you a question. Henry, sir. Must be cold down there, Henry. Put this on. Lice in the bed, sir. Eating me alive. Shirt keeps out the rats. Biggest ones I've ever seen. Oh, great. How are you sleeping? Don't sleep. Only thing I do in here is think. Lots of time for thinking. What do you think about? Oh, while well, dying mostly. And my little girl. She'll need you to be strong, Henry. This will be hard for her too. Been behind bars every day of her life. You don't even know I exist. I'm sure she can't wait to see ya with those Spider-Man tattoos. It's never too late to change her life, Henry. I'd like to come and see you again, if I may. Perhaps I'll bring some A&W. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. By the way, my real name's James Franco. Okay. Call me Walter. Um, James, I think Walter might have something for you. Can we do something about those rats? This isn't the third world. 
I'll get some rat poison in there. Laced in the Kool-Aid. Hey, looks like we gotta save James Franco. And this doctor can't go one minute without talking. Following the recent tragedy at El Camico State Prison, we are under immense political scrutiny. Until a permanent replacement is found for the CEO position. I'd like you to take the reins. Well, no problem. Just, you know, give me some time to build things. And don't call me every fucking two minutes, Walter. Break your legs and leave you in solitary. There have been a spate of suicides at this facility recently. And it's not hard to see why. But we have a more immediate problem. The powers that be have decided to send us a huge batch of new inmates. The first will be arriving tomorrow. We don't have anywhere to house them. We need you to build a brand new cell block. Oh shit. With enough space to handle the new intake. Oh, here we go. Oh, they already gave me the blueprint. I've laid out a potential design for the new cell block here. This should give us enough cells to handle the intake. And the design includes its own shower facility. Oh, aren't you swell? That's a giant extra area right here. Holy. Alright, so let's get these walls built. Should we do concrete? Same price. Fuck it. Alright. So all the walls should be good. Okay, shower. Jail doors. We need those everywhere. Alright, here's your beds. Fuck's sake. I guess a foundation would also work. Fuck. No wonder it's not letting me do the cells. I just build under the uh, walls there, boys. Should be easy. <laughs> Whoops. What the... Well, there goes all my walls. For fuck's sakes. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> well, this is a fuck up and a half. But, I guess I'm here to learn. Probably should have already known that. Ah, <sighs> utilities. Gotta get some water. Oh, I gotta provide a yard too. I didn't even see that one. Oh, shit. Yard? Throw a yard anywhere? Right outside. 30 by 13. Oh! Oh, shit! 40 escapes today. Oh, oh. Guess I should do... Some guards, four guards there. Yeah, let's do five. Oh my god, this whole time, look at this. Because I had flooring in between the door and the cell. It didn't count the cells. Jesus, this is just going shit. Oh, well, I guess I need a wall there. Shut up. Shut up. Alright, what do you want? I'm having a hell of a time here. Oh. I was hoping to see you at one of my sessions. I can't do it. I can't stay in this hole any longer. Just take a day at a time. I mean, the whole stinking place. In here. Out there. They won't let me see my family. I messed up, sir. And that ain't about a change. 
Henry, it's going to be okay. I'm right beside you, my son. It's funny, he said the exact same thing. Who? Who, Henry? You can tell me. Oh, no. One of the guards have his way? He looked out for me. Oh, look at these sly motherfuckers. With an Uzi and a shotgun. Ever since we were kids. Oh, Robin a Brinks truck. Oh, Benedict. Keep your shit together. Whatever happens, kid. I'm right beside you. Oh, shit. Hands up, motherfuckers. Grab the money, kid. I'm taking that and that. I guess I'll leave the rest in the back. Oh. That was quick. Drop your weapons now! Fuck you! Oh shit. Shoot, goddammit! Holy shit. What the hell are you waiting for? Shoot, you fucking pussy! Oh my god! Oh! Clipped in the shoulder. Shit, shit, shit! Don't shoot, don't shoot! Oh, Henry was a wuss. Couldn't go through with it. Right beside me? He ain't there no more. I'll make you an agreement. Come to my next group and I'll see if we can relax your visitation privileges. You do that for me, sir? Covered in this shit? It's not just for you, Henry. Oh. Here we go again. We've treated these men like dirt for too long. That ends now. Previous CEO was never a big believer in prison reform. But the way I see it, we need to provide these men with some sense of hope for the future. We need to give them the skills they need to succeed when they're released. Valuable trade skills. A basic education. We should start work on an apprenticeship scheme. Train these men with some real world skills. So they at least have a future they can look forward to. Alright, more shit. Authorize prison labor through bureaucracy. Alright. The hell's that? Train five inmates in kitchen safety and hygiene. Assign inmates to work in the kitchen. Build up a workshop. Oh, here we go. Prison labor. Takes about an hour. Give some time. Kitchen safety and hygiene. 33 interest. Very nice. So work and free time. All the way up to 10 a.m. All right, so we gotta build a workshop. I guess right in the middle. Remember, foundation first. Holy shit! There we go. Hey, you know, there's a couple of unconscious guys just sitting there. All right, well, the guard just walks right past him. 
Workshop, we need a workshop saw, a press, and an oak table. Hopefully no one goes nuts on the saw, if you know what I mean. Okay, workshop is done. There we go, there's some inmates. Two of them. Four there. There we go. That's easy. There he is, Walter Hurst. I managed to persuade the chief to make an exception for Morgan's family vegetation. Oh, how nice of him. Oh, no. Check her for files, you never know. Carrie Morgan. Hello, sir. Carrie Morgan. Here to see Henry Morgan. Behind the line. I'm sorry. I'm here to see Henry. Henry Morgan. He's my husband, sir. I won't tell you again. Behind the line now. What is up with this guy? What a dick. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. What a fucking asshole. Wow. Okay, come forward. I haven't gotten all day. What? I hope he gets killed. Can I assign a prisoner to kill him? Name? Carrie Morgan, sir. Here to see Henry Morgan. And this here is his baby girl. That's what you tell him, is it? Oh, wow. Never stops being a dick. Carrie! Oh. Afraid there's been a mistake. Morgan's lost his visitation privilege. What? I thought I just got a bet. Oh. Now the kid's pissed. I'm sorry. We found liquor in his cell this morning. There's nothing I can do. Oh, son of a bitch, Henry. It took me two hours to get here. My daughter's crying. This isn't fair. You want fair? Go to Disneyland. All the guards sound the same, by the way. Fair is somewhere where you win goldfish and eat hot dogs. What? You won't find it here. Well, that's a new definition of fair I've never heard of before. Goldfish and hot dogs. All right. Please, give him this. Oh. The guard probably going to rip it up and shit on it. Sure thing. You won't be having visitors for quite some time. Any message? No. Tell him to go fuck himself and stay out of the liquor next time. <sighs> what a shitty prison. No! James Franco! He's gonna flip. Oh! Wait! You can't do this! Oh my god. Let me talk to her! Oh! Yep, throw him on his back? You fucking assholes! Calm down, Mr. Franco. Poor Hendry. Oh great, Walter Hurst again. That is very disappointing, yeah, well... It is so difficult to find ways to genuinely help these men. They really need to be taught to help themselves. I think it's clear we need to tackle the visitation facility. Families are queuing out the door, and we clearly can't handle the volume of visitors we are now seeing. 
build a brand new visitation facility. Despite what happened to Morgan, I think we'll see a positive benefit. And he isn't the only inmate here with family. Holy fuck, and a classroom! Holy, I haven't even got the other shit done. Alright, well, I guess we're doing a new visitation center, for fuck's sakes. Where? I have no idea. Expand to 80 cells capacity. What the shit? Now well, there's some more. Do I need to build a new fucking building here? I guess. Holy shit. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Oh my god, what is going on? What the hell? Right, please. Get him in. Oh my god. Me more right, please. Holy shit. Yeah, all the guys are okay, kind of. Oh my god, look at this mess. Oh, look at the bloodbath. Oh, uh, do we have an infirmary? No, we don't. Great. Alright, now I need a mailroom, I guess. Didn't see that. Holy shit, anything else, Uncle Lewis? You can tell me. Oh my. And build a fucking chapel. Alright, there's a chapel. I'm pretty much building my own prison right now. Holy shit. So many fucking rooms. Oh my god. It worked. Holy shit. They're finally able to get into the visitor center. Holy shit. And there it is. Took three seconds. Great. Great. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Three seconds. Sorry, sir. I thought you ought to know. There's been another suicide. Yeah, surprise it wasn't me. Looks like one of the prisoners ingested rat poison. Oh, no. Dr. Hurst is on the way there now. To confirm. Oh, shit. Oh. What? Ain't she the most beautiful thing you ever seen? Oh, Henry! Ah, oh, I think she might be. Never too late to change a life, sir. Well, James Franco's looking pretty good now. Was that the end? Okay. I think we've made a big difference here. We've given these inmates something to work towards, and a reason to keep going. You can stay and help us see the first batch of inmates through education and work programs we've set up, if you want. Nope! But I think we can handle it from here. When you're ready to leave, click the Polaroid in Morgan Cell. Well, I think I'm good, because I just spent an hour friggin' around. Good lord. Yeah, expand to uh, 100... Okay, I know how to build cells, so we're good. This is just alright. So where's this Polaroid? It's over here. Let's 
get her done. Okay, that was the end. You guys can't see that. Or that. 